Hello everyone, my name is Joshua Oyebamiji. I work with the POS operation team in Kudi. Firstly, I want to sincerely apologize for the different errors um, and downtimes you've been having with your POS terminals. We couldn't help on our own part because we also depend on the third party stakeholders. We have NIBS, we have um, Bank, and we have um, the PTSP. But at the same time, we are here to give you a solution that we feel is going to work um, for your POS terminal. I'm going to show you the update process on your POS terminals now. Okay, so from the home page, um, press the enter button and press the F button and press cancel immediately. You have to be fast about this um, to avoid it timing out. So select number three and um, select option three again for initialize. Now input the password one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight and press enter. Okay, here you're going to select number four for GPRS. Now you start pressing the enter button. Keep pressing enter on the terminal shows connecting. All right, so you can see handshaking with CMD. Okay, when you see this, just press the enter button. Sub R will be deleted, finish settlement. Enter to delete sub app or cancel to exit. Please press enter button. The terminal will start downloading. Also, so why you want to do this, um, I will advise you have enough airtime on the SIM card in the POS, okay, to avoid it breaking. Okay, so the POS is going to go off after this update, you can see. It will, ask, it will advise you to restart the POS, but it will go off first, then you restart. The POS is off now, so I'm going to restart the terminal. So once this POS come up, we are going to do a key exchange. I believe a lot of people are used to the um, POS um, key exchange process already. So as you can see, parameters updated. Okay. Okay. We all remember the password. Six zeros. So, press enter okay so here we go to admin number four then we input the password again six zeros then number one select number one for logon number one again for trans logon then input the password zero one the username zero one press enter and the password four zeros one two three four and press enter linking then it's download keys from tms that's terminal management system so after this key exchange we're going to try a transaction um, to see if it approves or not. So as you can see, logon success. So it's going to print the parameters now. Okay, so we have the current notif app on this POS now. 
So after the update process, I will advise you to do a test transaction on your POS terminal. I'm very sure you have an approved transaction after that. Thank you so much for choosing Kudi.